What's going on YouTube? Here's a quick 15 card order from SGC. It was the football special they were running. As you know, it's $15 a card. Any football card, any year. 15 bucks, can't beat that. It was two weeks door to door. But yep, let's get into it. First up, 1988 tops, Joe Montana, got a nine. Soft centered at the back, but the front was center good. Thought I had a shot at a 10. Probably not worth sending in, but I'll keep it as a PC card. Next up, 21 Panini Spectra Rising Rookies, Jalen Waddle. Got a nine. This one's numbered out of 99, so I'm happy with that. The thicker cards, they, um, they're they tough to grade, so anytime I get over an 8, I'm happy with it. I'll settle for a 9. Next up, Chris Olave. Uh, this is the base optic, 2022 optic. Got a 10. Not much to say about that. It's a new card. You should be getting 10s if you're sending them in. New base card. Uh, here's another Chris Olave. This one's the Select um, Rookie Swatches, the Red Prism. It's not numbered or anything, but I figured it's got to be a short print, and it looked clean. I figured I'd send it in. I pulled it in a break. Happy with a 9.5. It's a thicker card, so that's the exception. If it's, if it's a new thick card, 9 or better is what you're looking for. Next up, 21 Donros Optic. This is the Blue Scope Prism, Amon Ross St. Brown. It's got awesome shine. Got a 9.5. So obviously hoping for a 10, but I'll settle for a 9.5. Next up, another Jalen Waddle. This is the, um, the Laser Prism. It's got awesome shine to it. I pulled this in a break too. I like this card a lot because it has the orange that matches its uniform. But yep, got a 10, happy with that. Another receiver, AJ Brown. This is the 2019 Panini Illusions. This one got a 10. I think he's gonna have another big year this year. Man, I love this set. It reminds me so much of the Flair Showcase sets from uh, the mid to late 90s. Awesome card. Next up. 2011 Panini Contenders. This is the rookie ticket of uh, Justin Houston. It's a rookie auto. It's not an on-card auto. You can see it's a sticker, but still a rookie auto. I think he has a legit shot at the Hall of Fame. He's already got a lot of career sacks, and I think if he has one or two good more seasons, he'll, he'll make the Hall of Fame. But yeah, that's his rookie auto. Got a nine. I have another copy I was going to send in too, but this was the cleaner one, so I figured I'd send that. Next up... Uh, 2020 Don Ross Optic Elite Series Rookies, Justin Herbert. This one got the 10. Happy with that. I think he's going to have a big year this year. He did good last year, and that was considered a down year. Imagine that. <laughs> Next up, 94 Upper Deck SP, Bryant Young. This one got a 10. This set's, uh, you know, this is tough to get high grade, so... I'm really happy with this. this. is a low pop card. And he just got into the Hall of Fame last year, so. I figured I'd send it out. It looked clean. Uh, 91 Upper Deck Brett Favre. <laughs> this reminds me of something about Mary when he's in it with Warren. <laughs> but yeah, I had a bunch of these factory sets, and this one was clean. It got a 10. The one I sent in with the last order. I got a nine, so I'm happy with that. Next up, 16 Optic, uh, Dak Prescott. This one got a 10. I, I got this at a card show and it looked clean. And I figured I'd send it in and made the right choice. It got the 10. Sort is good, a lot of 10s. Next up, 1990 Fleer. Uh, this is the update, Evan Smith. Got a, got a 10. It's a little off center, top to bottom, but it was in in reason that it would get the 10. It's crazy. He's got the most rushing yards of all time, and a lot of people consider him to be the best rusher of all time. Well, running back, and 
his stuff really isn't going for that much. Me personally, I'm a Cowboys fan, love Emmett, but I think Barry Sanders is the best running back ever. But that's me. Next up, uh, 2001 Pacific. This is uh, the Brown Royal. It's Spurger win and Drew Brees. It's considered Drew Brees' rookie card. It's only numbered out of a thousand, so this was a clean copy. I was honestly, I was thinking this was gonna get a nine just because the die cuts. It's it's almost impossible to get a ten, but sure enough, this one got a ten, and it's considered Drew Brees' rookie, and it's only numbered out of a thousand. I'm sure that's a really low pop card. And the last card of the order, this is a PC card. I've had this since I'm a little kid. Um. This is the 2002 Fleer Genuine Tom Brady Genuine Article Material. It's uh, it's numbered out of 500. It's an actual game-worn jersey, well, piece of a game-worn jersey that Tom Brady wore in 2001. And yep, like I said, it's numbered out of 500. It was a pretty cool card too. Like you could, it, there's like a ticket slipped in here. You could pull it out, but. I just wanted it encapsulated. I'm really happy it got a nine because as you can see, that corner is dinged. Not dinged, but it's it's worn. The, the paint came off the card. But aside from that, it was a really clean card. Um, I think they were a little bit genu generous with the, with the nine, but you're not gonna hear any complaints out of me. Again, it's the GOAT second year card, a game-worn jersey, come on. Anyways, that's it. Um, I'm hoping SGC runs another special. I'll gladly send in more cards. But until then, we'll see what happens. Anyways, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.